calling fractions. So starting off with the first part here, 5, we can break this down to 1 over cosine theta. That's the same thing as the secant. And then tangent can be broken down to sine theta over cosine theta. And we can further make this into 1 over cosine theta times... And when you divide by a fraction, it's the same by, as multiplying by the reciprocal. So we get 1 over sine theta, which is the same thing as the secant theta. All right, so here we can break this down into uh, 1 minus sine squared theta is the same thing as the cosine squared theta. And then cotangent could be broken down to cosine squared theta over sine squared theta. And this can be rewritten as cosine squared theta times sine squared theta. Uh, whenever you, again, multiply by or divide by something, you can multiply by its reciprocal. These cancel out, and you're simply left with sine squared theta. And then here, break this down to sine of theta over, and then cosecant the same thing, same thing as one over sine squared theta, or sine theta, cancel out cotangent theta, and the reciprocal of cotangent's tangent. Here we have cosine theta over one over cosine theta. cosecant squared theta or cosine squared theta and that's it okay i hope this helped you out i appreciate you watching the video and you have yourself a great day